This is a Betts patent portable globe, made to fold easily for travel and storage. And Betts, uh, John Betts, took out his patent on this portable globe in 1856, but most of them were made by George Phillips um, Limited. And this one certainly will come in a little bit closer and you can see the label there with all of the details. But of course, the great thing about maps and globes are you can date them fairly accurately because of the geographical changes that went on, the countries that changed, empires that changed, etc., etc. And this one we can date to 1918 to 19. And the way we're doing that is if we look at Europe, we can see that the countries that were part of the Austro-Hungarian Empire have changed to be named individually. But also, Ireland is shown as part of Great Britain. Um, hadn't become the Republic of Ireland just yet. But those two facts allow us to date it to 1918 to 1919. Now, of course, you want to see how it dismantles. And it's an umbrella mechanism. We've got a little clip here. We push that, and there you go. Nice and simple, packs down very easily. This originally would have gone into a tube just to protect it when not in use. The very first ones had wooden boxes. More often than not, um, these globes, when you're lucky enough to find them, have been separated from their tube. Occasionally you might see one with. But the great thing about this is the condition of it. Of course, by their nature and the mechanism, they're quite fragile. This is probably wax linen, and there's a certain amount of pressure on opening and closing it with the umbrella mechanism. And so a lot of them have damage to the bottom, they have tears. Um, and to find one in such good condition is quite unusual, really. So when we open it, we've got to make sure that all of the folds are in place, so we don't get snagged up and it opens nice and easily so there you go let's spin your world round for you a bet's patent portable globe first um, conceived in and patented in 1856 by john betts this one made 1918 to 1919 and uh, really in great condition.